If you're looking for the best polarized sunglasses for fishing, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have costed Del Mar Men's Blackfin 5 108i Brown sunglasses. The Blackfin has withstood the test of time, earning their place as one of the most popular fishing sunglasses Costa has ever produced. This could almost be expected from a company founded by fishermen who were not satisfied with other sunglasses on the market. Blackfin shades are built on a nylon frame with insert molded rubber grips on the temple arms. The shape is classic, curving, and wrapping around the eyes and temple for a seamless look. There's also a nice variety in the frame colors, from understated black and gunmetal to real tree camo or tortoise. The lenses are what Costa was founded on, so it should be no surprise that anglers love the clarity of the Blackfin. Whether you choose the 500 i polycarbonate or 590 glass, you are getting a high-tech engineered lens designed with fishing in mind. Moving on to the next at number two with Oakley Men's U9000 14 Gaskin sunglasses. Oakley has long enjoyed having a stellar reputation among athletes and outdoor enthusiasts. Oakley sunglasses could always be counted on for razor-sharp optical clarity, light and weight, and a badass look. For a long time, most Oakley glasses were even made in the USA. Times and businesses change, and now many Oakley sunglasses are made overseas. Has there been a drop in price or quality because of these business moves? The answer to both appears to be no. Oakley is still a top brand of polarized sunglasses and they remain at premium prices. Looking at the gas can, we can see a tough, rectangular design reminiscent of its name. The frame is thick, but not bulky. The lenses look as if they were cut from a continuous piece of polycarbonate that really makes a sleek appearance. The polarized plutonite lenses are great for fishing and hunting, as well as performing as your everyday carry sunglasses. The number three position is held by Native Eyewear Adeline Rectangular Sunglasses. Native makes a full line of solid mid-price sunglasses. They don't have the name or recognition of the huge brands, but don't let that fool you. Native makes high quality and comfortable sunglasses. In fact, they could be thought of as having some of the best fishing sunglasses for the money. The frames are made of a lightweight and durable castor resin and cam locking temple for a secure fit. Keep in mind the Edeline model has a medium sized frame best for average size faces. Next at number four, we have Costa Del Mar Men's Fantail 508 Iper Tangular Sunglasses. The Fantail is the smaller sibling of the Blackfin. If you fell in love with the fit and clarity of the Blackfin, but found them to be a little too wide for your face, look to the Fantail as a direct alternative. They have the same great lenses and stylish frames. There are reviews saying the rubber co-molding falls off the frame over time. Typically one, two years, but Costa has since come out with a next generation frame and molding that seems to have solved the issue. The number five position is held by Oakley Men's OL 9096 Fuel Cell Polarized Wrap Sunglasses. The Oakley Fuel Cell Sunglasses are not for the timid. Their shape and styling are aimed towards outdoorsmen and shooters who prefer tough, aggressive lines in their eyewear. Fuel Cell is the choice for many tactical enthusiasts, including US Special Forces teams. The Fuel Cell is built from the patented O, matter, R resin, said to be stress resistant. The shades meet, and exceed the specs for the ANSI Z87.1 impact test, so they are a good option for fishing, hunting, and shooting. When comparing the Oakley Fuel Cell VS Gas Can, you will find the Fuel Cell is a bit wider, with a larger frame overall. The Plutonite lenses are typically high quality you'd expect from Oakley. They block out 100% of the harmful UVA of UVC light. The lens coatings are hydrophobic, helping to reduce smudging and repels dust and water, all of which happen frequently on the water. The number six position is dominated by Wiley X Polarized Sunglasses. Wiley X was founded by a military veteran and started out designing optics for military and police forces. Over time, they have grown into a major supplier of sunglasses to the US military and special forces. That kind of foundation lends a ton of credibility to the fishing and outdoor market. All Wiley X sunglasses must meet the ANSI Z87, Point one standard for high velocity impact. Anglers who do a lot of flipping and grasp, mat punching would be wise to consider that fact. A projectile one oz tungsten weight can do a surprising amount of damage to an eye should it take a directed. The P17 has a similar wraparound design compared to the Costas, 
but the temple arms are narrower. There's the option of gloss black or gloss demi, tortoise with emerald mirror, or smoke green lenses. The Wiley Slay is a great alternative to the pricier Costas and is excellent for fishing and all-around outdoors use in their own right. Moving on to the next and number seven with Smith Survey Sunglasses. Smith Optics is one of the oldest sunglass companies in the U.S. Founded in 1965 by orthodontists with an addiction to the ski slopes, Smith developed advanced ski goggles with breathable lenses. Today, Smith has developed Chroma Pop, an advanced polarized lens technology. Chroma Pop technology uses two wavelength filters to present a more natural and higher definition of color to the eyes. The filters help distinguish between blue, green, and red, which is something the eyes have trouble with on their own. For fishing, that means seeing grass and objects under the water. The Smith Survey glasses are the type of fishing shades that can be worn all day, whether on the water or in the truck. They have a timeless wraparound shape that would look great on anyone. The resin frames come in several sweet-looking colors like flecked green tortoise, bronze mirror lens, matte camo, platinum lens, brown, amber lens, and of course, all black and gray-green lens. All of those lens colors work well for fishing. The number eight position is held by Flying Fisherman Unisex Adult Buchanan Sunglasses. I had never heard of Flying Fisherman until doing the research for this guide. I was surprised to see such high user ratings for such inexpensive sunglasses. If you are looking for the best cheap fishing sunglasses, these might just be it. When my gas station shades finally give out on me, I just may try the Buchanan to keep in the truck for driving. The nice thing about cheaper sunglasses is you can buy several pairs with different lens colors and still make it home under the price of one premium set of glasses. The Buchanan lens system is scratch resistant with a cool tint colors that bring out contrast without messing up the clarity or true life colors. Next at number nine, we have Strike King polarized Okeechobee sunglasses. Strike King in recent years has entered the low end sunglasses market with its line of Sullivan sunglasses. Each frame style bears the name of legendary fishing lakes. The Okeechobee frames are the most popular among base anglers who are comfortable with the wraparound style between the Buchanan and the SK Okeechobee. You have two of the best fishing sunglasses under $50. There are a lot of similarities between the two. It comes down to which style and lens color you prefer. Strike King Sullivan has more colors to choose from and offer the same level of polarization and UV ray protection. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Costa Del Mar Women's Water Woman Two Round Sunglasses. Costa thought to help female anglers by designing sunglasses that not only look good but fit the female face as well. The Water Woman Two sunglasses are designed with a feminine. They also offer their frames in different colors to be more feminine. Instead of only offering matte black, Costa offers jade, transparent beige, and shiny American sky colors. The main feature here, which I want to dive into is the large lenses that these come with. On the one hand, I love them because they stop the UV rays from reaching the eyes and allow you to better see fish in the water. Also, the lenses weigh down the glasses, so they aren't going to fall off should you hit some rough water. However, you might find the large lenses a bit annoying due to the weight and size. If you wear a hat on the water, like my wife, they will push the bill of the hat up. In my personal opinion, I'd suggest grabbing these if you're a female angler because I value eye protection over comfort. And these do just that. That's all for today. We upload fashion product review videos every single day. So don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.